For the whole ensemble? The whole get up. The yeah. whole, the whole deal. Not the outlet store prices. Uh, yeah. Right. But that had a very Ralph Lauren look. Oh, and yeah. It, the, yeah, it's the, iconic. It, I, they very always iconic. Look nice. No yeah. doubt. All right, let's take a look at um, our little slice of America. There we go. We're down in the. Uh, uh, the first word area, and we've got a uh, kind of a muggy, hazy, quiet summer day. All is right. It's good. We've got uh, a small chance of a thunder shower today, but a chance nonetheless. Uh, tonight down to 65. Tomorrow, uh, a similar deal. Uh, thunderstorms may be a little bit more feisty tomorrow. Um, we'll watch how that goes. Buffalo may have a chance of getting shadowed from the lake here, uh, but still, uh, some parts of western New York may see some stronger storms for your Wednesday. want to show you this because uh, it really tells the story about humidity, which is going to peak tomorrow and then take a nosedive like a Greg Louganis 1984 Olympics dive. I think he was in 1984. Um, and go down and be very comfortable Thursday, Friday into Saturday as we are going to see a much more uh, less humid, comfortable weather pattern take place. All is quiet now. Nothing showing up on radar or satellite just yet. Um, we're going to wait just for the heating of the day to possibly percolate a couple of showers. This model here is kind of showing. See these yellows and greens? That's some indication of some rain cooled air that could occur uh, near the Erie Canal if some of these storms form. For the southern tier, upper 70s, close to 80 degrees. Future look shows that right here couple of storms and I, I got to tell you, we were looking at this thing yesterday. It nailed that storm that hit East Aurora last night. So, you know, just gives you an idea to heads up a couple storms near Lockport, Medina, possibly towards the Tonawandas into the southern tier where there could be a couple of heavy downpours. Nothing widespread, many areas high and dry. Uh, still some showers into this evening, possibly overnight across the southern tier. We'll see. And then tomorrow, notice the edges of the lake kind of pick up some of the storms. A little bit of a shadow potentially from Buffalo to Batavia, but maybe a few of the storms dropping upon the city later on. So anyway, tomorrow's a day to be maybe a little more sky aware than today because some of the storms could pack a bit of a punch. Uh, mostly sunny to partly cloudy, an isolated thunder shower uh, tonight. Should be dry, but maybe some showers scooting by to the east quickly. We'll watch that. Long range forecast. Good living Thursday, Friday, 70s, and then 80s with sunshine for the weekend.